In a recent House Oversight and Subcommittee on Health hearing, former NCAA swimmer and women's sports advocate Riley Gaines defended herself and other witnesses accused of transphobia for opposing transgender males in women's sports. Such as teamwork and goal setting. In terms of mental health, studies show that participating in youth sports is associated with lower rates of anxiety and depression, lower amounts of stress, higher self-esteem and confidence. Women must stop. Inclusion cannot be prioritized over safety and fairness. And Ranking Member Lee, if my testimony makes me transphobic, then I believe your opening monologue makes you a misogynist. Thank you. Now, the hearing mainly focused on the Biden administration's proposed Title IX rule change, expanding sexual discrimination to include gender identity. And of course, the debate escalated even further as AOC raised concerns about potential genitalia examinations for underage women if biological men were barred from women's sports. But at the end of the day, should government really be involved in making these decisions at all?